there's a foundational teaching of Christianity that time and time again I find that people just don't accept or don't realize. And it's this. When the Son of God took on our humanity, when, as the book of Hebrews tells us, He partook of our flesh and blood, that was not temporary. When the Son of God became one of us, when He took on our humanity, that was everlasting. From the moment of His conception inside the Virgin Mary's womb, forever now, He remains not only God but also man, not only fully divine but also fully human, a flesh and blood man, crucified, resurrected, ascended, and glorified, a man, that man Jesus Christ, sits at the right hand of the Father. And that's great news for us. It means that Christ, who is the mediator between God and man, is fully divine with his Father and fully human with us. The book of Hebrews tells us, since the children share in flesh and blood, he himself likewise partook of the same things, that through death he could destroy the one who has the power of death. Christ took on our humanity and in dying destroyed the power of the devil by going into death itself. And he remains fully human with us in his resurrected body, now sitting at the right hand of the Father, interceding for us.